we see many things around us. Some are living things, while some are non-living things. Things that have life are living, like human beings, animals and plants. Things that do not have life are non-living, like umbrella, basket, fire engine and many more. Living things can move and can grow. They need food and water. They can breathe and can reproduce. While non-living things cannot move, grow, breathe, reproduce and they do not need food and water. Let's study in detail. Living things can move. Human beings move using their legs. Animals also use their legs to move. Animals without legs crawl, slide or swim using their body. Plants also show some movement, like the sunflower follows the direction of the sun. Non-living things do not move on their own. A car cannot move until someone drives it. Living things grow. A baby grows into a child, which then grows into a man. A calf grows into a cow. A seed grows into a plant, which then grows into a huge tree. Non-living things do not grow. A pen stays the same size even after 20 years. Living beings need food and water. Human beings depend upon plants and animals for their food. Plants make their own food using water, air and sunlight. Animals depend upon plants or other animals for their food. Since, non-living things do not grow. They don't need food or water. A ring doesn't need food or water. Living things can breathe. Human beings and animals breathe in fresh air using their lungs. Plants breathe in air from the surroundings. Non-living things can't breathe. A bat cannot breathe in air. Living things reproduce. Reproduction is the process in which a living thing gives birth to a young one of its own kind. A woman gives birth to a baby. A cat gives birth to a kitten. Birds lay eggs, from which young ones come out and slowly grow into adult. Non-living things do not produce their offsprings, which means they do not reproduce. A bottle does not give birth to a new bottle. Yeah. We can see the summary of the complete video. We hope that you have understood the concept of living and non-living things. Now, here's a secret on how you can study effectively with the Edurev app. You can learn with chapter notes, watch video lectures and solve MCQ tests of this chapter on Edurev. And that's not all. You also get amazing courses for class 5 and much more for your class 5 preparation. Thank you.